And here we go again. Today I'm going to go um, back over one of my favorite throws, uh, the six deuce. So again, I always go back to the six deuce. I, I don't know what it is about it. I love it. I cherish it. It, it more often than not, it serves as a long lasting role. Um, I get the money, I get out. So we're going to uh, shoot for points today. Let's see how we do. Let's just try and do a, uh, a hit count. And pretty soon I want to go ahead and play one of these with the six deuce and have a betting session. Because if there's one thing I've learned is make craps a short game. And that you go, you make a point, you hit four, five, maybe six rolls, whatever you trust yourself with. At that time, take your place bets off or turn them off. Don't always pull them down, but turn them off. So make a point, hit your numbers, three, four, five times, whatever you're comfortable with, and then turn those off. Wait until a new point is established, or God forbid if the seven comes out, all that money that's up there is safe and still in your pocket. So you have to play craps as a short game. I, I that's, that's what I've been told, and that's a very true thing. Um, don't go for the 20 or 30 roll thing because if you're expecting that you to do that somebody else to do it you're just gonna be disappointed it's not gonna happen um, somebody's gonna get lucky and somebody's gonna have a roll like that but it, you can't expect it so play the game to win make a point hit four three four five times turn your numbers off and just shoot when you hit that point when you hit the point turn it back on again after the fact but hit three or four more times turn them back off you're gonna make money after you make your initial bet system back after you make your bet money back you're on casino money baby you're playing for free you're charging them to play so play smart craps is a short game <sighs> Let's try the six deuce today and uh, see if it, you know, we, we can make it work. Let's do this. Okay, we have the deuce. Okay, that sucked, okay. Oh, one more time, one more time, one more time. Son of a bitch. We gotta do this, we're gonna do it right, right? That was better. All right. Six deuce. I don't care. It's that way. It's that way. It's that way. Seeing a pattern here? I don't care. Just six two. So let's try. I'm gonna be playing in the middle of the table in the back. And a nice easy loft into around the wall. Say three, four inches back. But it's got to be a 45 degree angle. You don't want to rock them down there. And you don't want to scoot them across down there. It's got to be a 45 degree angle if you want to make it work. Two craps, two. I don't think I've rolled, I've rolled uh, two too often with this. But you know, it, it is what it is. rest the more action you get a lot of the random comes into play and it's out of your hands so control as much as you can for as long as you can that was that was not bad at all baby that's a nine okay so we lost a line picked up a line Lost a line and picked up a line, and now we're up on that nine. Oh, I'm a poet and don't know it. Eight easy. 
notice that one, I could actually see the, the back spin that I had had two, maybe three rotations. And I do believe that that is perfect. That's exactly what we want. Just a few rotations. You don't want to back spin to the point where it's catching on fire. So just a nice, easy rotation. Oh, shit. Dice off. I hate this part. Where are you? Where'd you go? Always do same dice. All right. Oh. Knees are not what they used to be, man. All right, don't lose focus. Back in the game. You see how that just hit, bumped, and stopped? That's the throw. That's the throw we want. Five. I mean, that, that, that was perfect. That was the perfect throw. Two craps, two. Wow. that nine. Eight, easy eight. argue that wouldn't have been counted but oh, I, sh I should have counted those before I collected them but overall 11 throws uh, I'm gonna try one more time I think that we can beat that way four. Front line, baby. Thank you. Let's do it again. That came in 
pretty hot. But eight. Easy eight. Short, easy six. You see, that's, that's something else. And you know what I'm gonna do, just for fun? Right in the middle of all this, let's act like we have four people back here as well. All playing the line. Not having room back here for the, the odds, but we get the line. Let's introduce that in here as well. Four, easy four. Eight, easy eight. Front line, baby! Studio. Man, back up on that four. Five again. Get pretty short, but that is a nine. Ching. Teach that five a lesson. Seven out. I threw that way too hard, way too heavy into that wall. I mean, it like hit right at this crack. Didn't have time to have any sort of life. I know what I did wrong, and I won't do that again. But so let's see, I, I, are we roughly about the same as we were last time? One hard way, hard four. One, sh one throw shy as last time. So um, again, this, this has always been one of my top throws, but it needs more practice. Uh, need to figure out, there's something with a landing zone. Uh, I, I'm either landing too close or not far enough, but that's, the last one was certainly too close because it, it I mean, there's half an inch, one inch in between these chips in the wall, and I just split the difference with that last throw. That was way too hard. So um, I just didn't get lucky on that outcome. Um,
But still, I'm going to come back with yet another 6.2 video once I figure that out because this is a roll. Um, it will always be a roll. It's a good set. It just works. So also practice on that. Give it a shot. Let me know what you think. Okay. Thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time.